In this quick video, we are going to show the external routing connector for Salesforce. This connector allows us to route Salesforce channel, like the chat channel, using the Genesis Powerful Orchestration Server. Let's take a look at the workflow. To simulate a Salesforce chat, we will use the Omni button from the Salesforce test page. The chat is offline because non-agent is online. So, now the agent will log in in Salesforce and put himself available for the chat channel. When this operation is done, our Omni button will be available to start a customer chat. Before starting the customer chat, the agent can log in also on the Genesis workspace. There will be the toolbar responsible for the interaction management. Of course, for both the Genesis and the Salesforce channel. As soon as the workspace is logged in, the connector will establish a stateful connection between Genesis and Salesforce. Now we can start a customer chat from the test page. The chat will be submitted through the external routing connector to the Genesis interaction server. The Genesis orchestrator can now search for the appropriate agent to route the chat. As soon as the chat is delivered as a Genesis work item, the agent can accept it using the workspace toaster. The workspace connector can now open the chat session inside Salesforce. The customer can now chat with the live agent session. When the chat is terminated, the agent can close it in Salesforce and automatically the interaction can be marked down also in Genesis through the workspace connector. In the next example, we will simulate an inbound call from a customer. When the call is routed to the agent, as usual, the agent can accept it from the workspace toaster. The workspace connector will search for the contact inside Salesforce and automatically can create a task inside the CRM for the inbound call. In the last example, we will show the click to call feature from Salesforce. The agent will be able to start a call from Workspace just selecting a contact inside Salesforce and clicking the phone number link in the CRM form. Thank you for watching this video.